The idea behind Fearless Extension is that we can begin to teach brand new students how to extend the spine without fear and to teach them to sense the back of their body in a way that feels interesting and that they can be curious about. And for us as teachers, it's a way in which we can build on their potential in terms of back bending so that we can move away from the mindset of protecting the low back at all costs and rather build the deep intrinsic strength that a body needs to develop extension from the very first time that they're in the studio. One of the big questions that I've always wanted to answer for myself and what I'm hoping we can answer today is how do we promote extension whether we're introducing it to a, a, a fairly new mover or we're re-educating an experienced mover, how do we cultivate extension in a body that potentially has fear, has limitations, has experienced pain or discomfort, has even had uh, injury, whether that's um, uh, sacroiliac joint uh, dysfunction or uh, sciatic pain to general disease and dysfunction in the pelvis and the low back, even to herniations in the lumbar spine, as well as fusions or rods in the spine. So I've been applying this work for a few years to a variety of, of clients, and it's been really amazing to see how we can restore the body's ability to extend in a very simple way. The tools that I'm gonna be sharing with you today, I think you'll find will help to introduce extension in a way that leads you and your student towards a, a bigger progression of movement over time, but that's also very exploratory so that you are able to engage in a conversation with your student that they can get invested in.